we have here addition and subtraction algebraic fractions. We know that we can subtract or add algebraic fractions when we have the same denominator. So first, let's check what we have here in the first denominator. We have t squared minus 1. So we can use difference of two perfect squares formula and we can rewrite that this is equal 1 over t minus 1 times t plus 1. Next we have plus t over and we have 1 minus t cube. If I rewrite one that this is 1 to third power is the same. Yes. So now we have here difference of two perfect cubes formula. So let me remind you this formula. When we have a cube minus b cube, this is equal a minus b times a square plus a b plus b square. In our example a is equal 1, b is equal t. So we will have 1 minus t times 1 in parenthesis plus t plus t square. And the last we will copy. We see that we have the same what we have here in the denominator. So minus 2 over t square plus t plus 1. So this is equal. So now let's look what we can do. We have t minus 1 and here is 1 minus t so we can factorize negative sign and we will have the same expression in parentheses. So first t minus 1 we will copy times t plus 1 and we have plus t we will copy and we will factorize negative 1 so it will be in parentheses will be negative 1 plus t and because I have t square here so I would change order I will put first the highest power t square plus t plus 1 and we have minus 2 over t square plus t plus 1 so this is equal first fraction we will copy t minus 1 times t plus 1 and we have negative and positive so it will be negative and we will have t over and now I will put first positive variable t minus 1 times t squared plus t plus 1 minus 2 over t squared plus t plus 1. So this is equal so now the least kind of denominator what will be we have t minus 1 so we have to put t minus 1 next we have t plus 1 so we have to copy t plus 1 and what else we have here t minus 1 and t square plus t plus 1 we need to have every expression which we have in parentheses in the denominator so now let's check first denominator we need to multiply numerator and denominator by t squared plus t plus 1. The same in the denominator. So now we have 1 times this whole expression, so it will be t squared plus t plus 1. So this is our first algebraic fraction. Next we have minus and we have what? The numerator must be the same. t minus 1 times t plus 1 times t squared plus t plus 1. So let's check now. We have t minus 1, we have t squared plus t plus 1, but we don't have t plus 1, so we have to put plus t plus 1 in the numerator and t plus 1 in the numerator. We have to multiply numerator and numerator by t plus 1 and the 
Numerator now will be t times t plus 1 is t squared plus t. And we have minus. We have to have the same denominator. So t minus 1 times t plus 1 times t squared plus t plus 1. So now we see that we have only t squared plus t plus 1. So we have to multiply in this denominator by t minus 1 and t plus 1. The same we have to do in the numerator. So now we will have in the numerator 2 times and t plus 1 times t plus 1 is t squared minus 1. This is this difference of two perfect squares formula. So this is t squared minus 1. So this is equal. Now when we have the same denominators, so we can copy denominator. And we have to start from the left side. We have t squared plus t plus 1. Next we have negative sign, so we have to open parenthesis and we have to put t squared. We have to write t squared plus t. And again we have negative sign, so again we have to open parenthesis and we have to write. I can put 2 before parenthesis t squared minus 1. So this is equal, again we have to copy the numerator plus 1 of course. So now we have to copy t squared plus t plus 1 and we have negative sign before parenthesis, so we need to change the sign. It will be negative t square and negative t. And now we will have negative times positive again, so it will be negative 2 t square. Negative times negative give me positive 2. Now we have to combine the like terms. Then we have to copy. So now we see that we can reduce t square and t square and t with t. So we have now negative 2t square and we have 1 plus 2 is 3. So this is my solution. We cannot factorize anything in the numerator so we cannot reduce. This is my solution.